dirt. Why do I get the feeling that it took a team of 50 marketing professionals weeks on end sitting in meetings to come up with that title? We could call the game Super Extreme Hyper Desert Buggy Cross HD Remix Prologue 7. Or we could just call it Dirt. That leaves them open for a sequel, Mud or Lava. I like the title, it gets right to the point. Because Dirt covers a variety of different races that all take place on surfaces that aren't just asphalt. That's the entire premise for this game. You're racing in rally races, you're racing on dirt, you're racing on tarmac, you're racing, you're racing through mud and gravel. And I like the direction that they took this game in that you're not just driving any one type of vehicle in any one kind of race. I mean, hell, they have big rig racing in here. And when I saw that, I practically jumped off the couch in joy because it's just something I've never seen in a video game before. And I was so happy to drive a big rig with a huge wing on the back and by the way, the menus in this game are really nice. Very well designed. I might be the only person that ever cares about menus, but this game has awesome menus that are easy to navigate and look cool. Does anyone else get the feeling that we're driving to the Overlook Hotel? I'll break this into a two-part review because there's a lot of stuff to show. And I'm a big fan of this game. I'm recording this at the beginning of 2009, and Dirt is a great example of an Xbox 360 game that came out a couple years ago. And these games drop in price very quickly. There's a lot of them out there. They're not exactly hard to find. So you can pick up a lot of these older games for 15 to 20 bucks. There's only a couple graphical issues that I saw when playing Dirt that are that make it clear that this game is already a couple years old. Other than that, it, it's a fun game. This is a good arcade style rally uh, truck driving, dirt buggy driving game. I don't, I don't even know what half of these kind of vehicles are. I don't follow this kind of racing at all, but I enjoy playing them in the game. Dirt is a very friendly driving game to just jump in and pick up and play, no matter what your skill level. They give you five different uh, degrees of difficulty in the game. I'm fairly experienced with driving games, so I picked it up. Amateur was way too easy, and the Pro-Am level, I felt, was actually a good challenge. I like the variety of races. Most of them are pretty short. Sometimes you're competing against the clock and you go through a number of time points that tell you where you're, where you're standing against your competitors. Other races you're actually competing against a pack of other drivers and cars or trucks. The rally races remind me of the old PlayStation game I used to like, Colin McRae Rally. And in fact, his name is, is in this game as one of your competitors. Sadly, he died a few years ago. I forget the name of them, but those huge dirt buggy looking things are, are a lot of fun to drive. There's other vehicles and other kind of races in the game. I'll get to those in part two. There are these uh, souped up monster truck UPS vans that you get to race at one point in the game. I'll show those in part two, but they remind me of something straight out of Mad Max or the Road Warrior. Like there should be some guy riding on top in a hockey mask with an M60 on a gun turret shooting your competitors. Maybe they'll add that into the sequel. Funk. Funk could be a great many things that you can drive through. Just use your imagination. And it can all be radioactive. And, you know, nothing makes a game more fun than a little post-apocalyptic mayhem. By the way, the driving style in the game definitely leans more towards the Gran Turismo or Forza style 
but I felt that the braking and the diversity of the handling characteristics between the vehicles was a little more on the arcade side. I like the way the game handles. It's not too simulation, but it's not too arcade. It's actually a nice balance right in the middle. We'll see you back here in part two. Left 